I think that's just the pressure of how much is how close we are to ending this is kind of getting to me, I think. I only wish that I had the chance to get him to him first. Bah! His body can rot in these waters for all I care. It does give a lot of artifact power, so I like that at least. Move quickly, Death Knight. These sea giants have an unsatable appetite. There's no glory or or honor in being digested. True, I guess. My kin are safe and the Sea Warden is dead. I will return to Janvik now. You do that, friend. Thank you for all the artifact power. If only it gave more. I might actually end up gaining a level from this. So I guess thanks, Liz, for all the quests. I guess. After all. I just don't want to do them. <laughs> uh, okay, let's do that one. That's the powder keg thing. I'm doing all the collection things, the fetch things, whatever you want to call them first. Because that's just the better way to do it, in my opinion. It seems to make... Because th the other things kind of just happen automatically and over time without you even really trying. To be fair, this, I could have done the same with the... Um, with the, whatever they are called. The prisoners. Right off the bat. Night. Night. 4 a.m. The best time to be alive. 4 a.m. There we go. I'm gonna have to clear out my bags once we're done questing here, too. After I take a break, of course, like I said. I'm right by your side. I'm not even trying to find these people, I just kind of am by accident. We're probably going to end up finishing Lost Army off stream season 2, because here's the thing, right? I plan to still do raids at the guild with this guy. So, it's going to be weird. But 7.2 is mainly going to be on my Demon Hunter. That includes the raid, so... Yeah, if you want 7.2, like I keep saying a million times, self-promotion. Look at these. Oh, that's how we got that one thing. Okay. Can we get this multiple times? Doesn't really seem like it. Brilliant. So glad that's the case. Right, where the fuck are these powder kegs now? Where are they? I don't see them anywhere. Ah, here they are. Oh. Oh, good. Oh, good. Armies of giants. Fuck it, I'm just gonna pull everything. I'm a tank I can handle, I'm gonna just do this. Bye 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 No, no, you think you kill me? I kill you first. Fuck your shit. War boy. Yeah, look, they're just all dying on top of each other. At least they're not elites. Alright, that was fast. That was very fast, actually. Like I said, once I put my mind to it, it starts going faster. That's the thing. Terry didn't tell me there was this much to it, though. I actually did ask him, I'm not going to lie, what I had to do for this. And he said it was easy. It's easy. It's just a pain in the ass. <laughs> That's what I should have asked him. Is it a pain in the ass, Terry? To which case, he would probably have said, well, it's, a, it's probably a filler quest. So why would it not be? <laughs> Which I would have been like, oh, okay, and not realized how bad it was until I actually did it. Please die. Thank you. There's another powder keg. It's also partially my fault I'm doing things this late, but the whole reason we're doing it this late is because we actually did try a valley today, if you can see by the calendar. Technically, t yesterday, but... I consider it one day. My sleep schedule is clogged. Alright, at least we don't need to kill any more sea giants. I would just need to find those weird abomination things. Then we should be all good to go. Where's more of those barrels? Well, hey, at least they'll all give us a bunch of artifact power we can just pick up all at once. That's good news, at least. Seriously, where the fuck are these barrels? Barrels! Powder cages, whatever the fuck you want to call them, I don't care. Where are they? Here's one. I just need one more now. Where is it? Is it actually in my bag? No. Okay. Thank God. Because I have, like, no inventory space for this. At all. I thought that was a barrel. 
What is this? Hello. I don't know what that is. It looks cool. I'll do with that. <sighs> Fuck it. I'll kill it. I'll kill the last sea giant. There's a barrel there. I wish to be done with this already. Get the fuck out of my way. Thank you. Have a good day. Fuck off. Fuck. I'm not gonna say anything. There. How could we have killed a little guy too? Bye. Those guys have a lot of mana. 14. Holy shit. I mean, that's not crazy crazy, but it's still good. See, I swear, it pisses me off, right? Because I'm exalted with, with Saramar now, and I'm finding all these different methods that I could have used to potentially get lots of mana. It's annoying. My opinion. This should also finish off the harpoons. Yeah, this wasn't as bad as I thought. We're almost done now. Now we just need to find the overseers and finish that up, and then we're good. We are finished at that point. Hopefully we don't have to go back to that cave. We can bring it all back to Jarvik. Did I just say Jarvik? Is that actually right? Jandvik. Jandvik. Janvik. I don't know. I don't know. Alright, we have all the harpoons. What else do we need now? Just one more over here, right? Yeah, just one more. Where is he? There? No. Where is the overseer? There, I see one. All right. And then I'd imagine, what else could we have to do? There is a small little group, so I'm guessing I have a feeling we'll just have to kill the Tide Mistress probably once and for all. I think I saw her, like I said, when I poured it over here in the first place. But like I said, if you don't know how to get over here, you can get a portal from the chests in the Wither Training scenario. That's how I got here. I probably would have never found this place otherwise. Maybe with a video, but that's a maybe, not a guarantee. Alright. Let's turn this in. Get some artifact power stuff. And continue to push forward. I'm getting less bitchy as time goes on now. Now that it's finally over. Move quickly, True Death. You made it back in time. Oh, come on! Can you feel true death? The waters turn with approaching Shashar. You must strike now. Leave me. Find a way to bombard the Nog with the cage. Protect Janvik. How? Oh. God damn it. Well, he died. Thanks, Blizzard, for making me feel like an asshole. Um. God. How do I? How do I bomb it? What do you want me to do about this? Oh, here we go. Okay, this shouldn't be too bad. Wow. That kills a lot of them, actually. Holy shit. We need to kill 50 Naga? Oh, God. We need to kill 50 Naga. Boom. Jeez. These things are really deadly. That guy's sacrifice was not in vain. Jesus. Alright, this is one of the more fun ones. I'm okay with this. I am okay with this. Boom. Oh god, that's quite a lot of Naga down there. Make sure we get them. Boom! I wish the radius was a little bigger. Doesn't seem to be that good. What? What do you mean no path? What do you mean? Boom. Okay, that's what happens if you do... How did one of them survive, though? That's the big question. Boom. Boom. Getting lots of kills. Hello, giant numbers, to finish off. This quest. How are you doing? Alright, that's the last group. We're done. I think. There we go. Yeah, we're done. Sweet. Alright, so now we take it all back. Yeah, okay. But yeah, so far, it's not terrible. It's just I'm impatient because it's the last thing in between me and being done. So I think that's mostly it. I know I was really bitchy with Moonguard too, but that's because I was... Again, I found it in the worst way possible. That's what I really hate about Suramar. A lot of these quests you have to find. They're not very self-explanatory. Like the rest of the game. So, that's kind of why Suramar has such a bad rep. That and, you know, how much we spend so much time here. 
That's another reason. And just because the city... There's a lot wrong with Surmar. A lot of people hate a lot of things about it. Let's be honest. Hey, Brando. Baldur died in honor of Janvik. We remember his bravery. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, art. I might as well type ass. Let's just be gone. What is it? Tell me is everything. Oh, here. I already did that. The Shashir forces are far greater than I imagined. They are. Now the actual person is here, though, against their will. I must express gratitude for the Vikral you have saved this day. So we technically just killed their leadership for no reason. The Time Mistress is a dangerous foe. We must be as cunning, just as cunning as her to defeat her. We will have all the parts that we'll need, we will need, two in some cases. I think she said more, not two. 300 mana. I'd say that's good, but it's really not, because we're done already here. The Time Mistress has fallen back to the Elven Ruins and is licking her wounds. Her guard is undoubtedly protecting her. To, be to best her, you will have to break her defenses. Construct the Ballista using the parts that you salvaged and end her once and for all. Okay. That sounds like it will be fun. End this once and for all. Can you? Can you? Fuck off. Oh, good, my boys. The Sashtir forces may have dwindled, but the Time Mistress has surrounded herself with her fiercest Naga. This is the time to strike a final crushing blow against the Sashtir. We can defeat them now. We must... We may... If we can defeat them now, we may finally break the, the back of this massacre and save the Genvic... Or the Menace. I'm sorry. I'm all over the place now. Toriel told me about those squid creatures that are controlling my brothers. I have never seen them... I've never seen anything like them before around Janvik. The Naga must have brought them for, from wherever they came. I do not want any more of my kin to suffer the fate of being controlled by the Naga. Find out where the squids come from and stop them. Wait, what? We already dealt with the squids. Why do it again? <sighs> okay, fine. We're going to that final island now. The island I was talking about where I think we actually spawned in here. So that made sense. This is ending how I expected it to. Wow, they fight fast. Actually, it was a move, but hey. Really? Right, let's just look, okay? So just like with Moonguard, this is why I find it annoying, right? I I'm pretty sure I'm right, just by the fact that this exists. Blizzard didn't put effort into this. How else can you explain that? How did that one slip them by? Anyone? No? Yeah. Anyway, um, let's finish this. I, I have a bad feeling this is all pointless. That that's kind of what the frustrates me the most. It's a cool story, it's you know, thanks for the RFA power, but why? It doesn't seem like there's any point to it at all at this point, which is really unfortunate. Let's wrap this up. I'm pretty sure this is the last one, because this is the last island now. We've done that. We've done everything, yeah. So let's just end this. Where are the inky? Oh, these things. Yeah, I've been, like I said, I've been over here already. I had to do this for a world quest, so I, I know what we need to do. I accidentally killed, I think, the Tide Mistress already once. But yeah, this should be the end, I'd imagine. I can't imagine this continuing any further at this point. But yeah, like I said, sorry I've been so bitchy. It's just, yeah, it's kind of obvious that this area wasn't really well cared for. And there's a little bit too much filler, in my opinion, for this. Had I not been streaming this or anything, I'd probably be okay with this and, you know, I'd take my time. But because it's in my way and I can only stream, well, not really stream, but, you know, record at certain times and whatnot, it, it's, it hurts me. It hurts my very soul. Once we're done with the incubators, we can just finish her once and for all. I don't know where this ballista needs to be made. Oh, apparently it's how we kill her, too. What the hell? I just killed her as murky. Because apparently there was a murky quest here. Yes, the Murky from Heroes. Yes, the Murky that we helped in those in uh, High Mountain. Same guy. Murky's awesome. He's fun to play with. And as. How do you even exist? There's an elite here. 
and I'm just tearing it apart. I'm not, I'm not even paying attention. It's going to be 880. <laughs> Down it goes. All right. One more. This is the person you have to kill for Murky. She's like, I don't know what she's doing. That's the thing I had to kill for the final world quest. I don't know what the point of the Naga arm moments are. I really don't. I don't think I ever figured that one out. I clicked on one and it said I could give 25 mana, but why would I want to do that? I still don't even know what they do. I'd imagine it probably just like does super damage or something. But it's 25 mana. 25 mana. But yeah, actually, fighting her as murky was kind of hard. Because she has a lot of guards which you're going to see soon enough. And they all pretty much just rush you. Oh, just get over here. I know you want to. And they're quickly. But you see, this is why I've been cutting out, say, the Suramar stuff. Like, uh, by that I mean the stuff where we do things in the city where we just kind of ran around. You know? Because I, I was trying to avoid this kind of behavior from me. Because, uh, yeah, I would pretty much be bitching off recording. Just like, what? why am I doing this? Building Ballista. So that's why I normally cut it out, but it's technically, this, this is the story. That's the thing. There's nothing to cut out. This is the story. Oh, God. Wow. She was completely decimated there. Oh, fuck. Okay, now we have to fight her. It's fine. I got you. She took massive damage. And... That's that. The Naga had been defeated. Thank God. We're done with that mess. Now, see, can we please tie it in with, like, the Naga are actually, like, nearby here, and that's part of the next expansion? Please, can we do something like that? But I, I even think that's far-reaching. I think this is just a case of filler. But we'll see. We'll see. They might find a way to incorporate this. And honestly, that would be great if they could. It'd be fucking fantastic with that. But I really doubt it. I really do. Okay. Almost over there, and then we should be done. And then I will take a break to hopefully calm down or just kind of pass out, either or. One or the other. I'll get a Coke or something, we'll see. If I pass out, obviously we'll continue tomorrow. For you guys, it'll all come out around the same time-ish. Obviously, I'll have to upload and I'll take a bit, but hey. Love you too. We may have finally overcome this Naga threat. I... I Good. Good, Blizzard. Good. Complete two quests without letting me read them. That's how much they care about it. You've done it, True Death. You've slain the Tide Mistress and saved Jane Vitz from the Shashjar. This is, I mean, that was it, but, but why? Why any of this? Hang on. Gather around the fire and hear the glorious news. Uh, oh, shut up, please. We have lost much of the hands of the Sashjar. Kaldur, Einar, and Jarl Thandrir have all fallen to their treachery. We all owe Janvit's salvation to one brave death knight. Glory to True Death, Slayer of Tide Mistress, whatever. Stop it, please. As sole remaining elder of Janvit, it is my duty to lead Janvit to, into prosperity. For this, I proclaim that True Death is the new Jarl of Janvit. Oh. Plot twist. Plot twist. I'm the Jarl. I'm the Jarl. That's why it matters. We can just make allies. I am king of this place. Blizzard. Let me just say this. I hated how much quests there were. I appreciate the artifact power because we were about to level up. But I like how you tied that in. That, thank you for that. I know I've been bitchy this entire part because, you know, obviously I wanted that lore master thing out of the way. And now it is. But I understand why you put this in now. We're now the Jarl, technically. Now, the, now what would be nice is if you can somehow incorporate this in the future in some way. So, please do. But if you don't, my criticism still kind of stands. It was all for nothing. It's filler. 
But anyway, now let's go turn in these war quests, see what the next objective is, and if it's a basic one, like just do stor more story, uh, I'm gonna take a break and calm down. I'm not even gonna cut it. I'm not even gonna cut it. Because at this point, you've, you've been suffering along with me. I, I might as well, you know, do it one more time. <sighs> it shouldn't be too long now, we're almost there. But yeah, at some point we're gonna have to do that. Do we have any artifact stuff now so we can get that last level or not? Not at all. Brilliant. Like I said, it brought us really close, we're just not quite there. Which is really unfortunate. Hopefully that'll count as an actual chapter or whatever to the quest line. Because, yeah, we have to do all of that before we can go into Nighthold. Well, technically, we could go into Nighthold now. There's no actual lock. But I, I you know, I, I like that it feels right, if you know what I mean, to do it in that order. Like, obviously, we have all these other Nighthold quests, but this is the main one to get you there, in my opinion. Did we finish Watson Crescent? Wait, no, Watson Crescent was earlier, I think. I think we're on an Elven problem now. In which case, we're pretty much done. Unless this isn't even the chapter complete, we'll see. One day at a time. Thank you, Shudef. Every day we come closer to freedom for Sermar. It wasn't even a chapter. Good. Good. Having Vefnir around has done much to lift the spirits of the people here. I dare say some have begun to relish their newfound freedom, even if they miss their beloved city. I will not rest until I give it back to them. You and I have an important meeting to attend. Before we go, let us distribute more of the Arkandor fruit. The classic. I want people to know that although I must leave for now, I have not abandoned them. Must be okay. Free. At least they don't make you pick it up anymore. Here. Random person, take this fruit. Arana Dora Esil, a thousand thanks upon you, of course, friend. Aran Arcana. Very well, let us go. Take me to your leader. I am glad you are here, Trudef. This Cadgar, the Archmage who found my message, has called a meeting. He wishes to meet us at the entrance to the city as soon as possible. Will you accompany me? I have the strangest feeling that he will not be alone. Be careful who you trust. Alright. Are we walking? Yeah, apparently we're walking. Okay. So this is the final this is at last the confrontation. Cadgar and her meeting at last. Finally, after all this time, we will understand why Alliance forces are fucking out there. Just, just, just out there. This will probably finally explain all that. What? It's only been four months. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, fuck off. We killed you so many times now. Uh, I, the, the whole concept of Saramar is poison to me now. I just I just want to be done with it. That's probably part of it too. We've just been here for so long, you know. But it is nice to see it all finally culminating together. That light spike, though. Ooh. All right, hi, Kaiger. Hello again, champion. I see we are all here now. It's only been a month. No more than that. It's been four months. Oh, good. I remember where your order stood in the War of the Ancients. How do we know you won't betray us and become the next Elisai? The next Elisai. We do not intend to be slaves to the Night World. We seek to drive the Legion from Suramar and put an end to Elisai's oppression. The Kaldori will fight to see the Legion defeated and the Night World destroyed. Beyond that, we shall see where Elune's wisdom is. Okay, so this is like a meeting of the elves so type situation. Your knowledge of the enemy will be crucial in the battle ahead. We shall call on you as needed. Okay. The night will call us you must move quickly, Trudef. I must save as many of my people as I can before the attack begins. Word has gone out in the city that there is a safe haven with us, and some no longer fear our exile. Venture in the Grand Promenade Champion. Find those willing to join us and let them know it is time they made their escape. Okay, so we're just basically fighting the Grand. Okay. 
Good, that should be enough. First things first, Trudef, we must set up our camp. We do not have the time or resources for a prolonged siege. It is not like we can ser starve them out. No, we must be swift and sure as an arrow, piercing their heart in one strike. They are drawing us, drawing up their battle lines within the city, but could attack us while we are setting up our defenses. Venture forth and show them what the Tal'Darai have learned from thousands of years of war. Discover their weakness that we may now exploit them. That we may, whatever. We stand together. Taking a promenade. These people are foreign to us, despite our common heritage. They have changed much in their years. They have been cloistered away. In the years they have been cloistered away. We need to learn more about them. What they are capable of. We dispatch one of our scouts to infiltrate the promenade and assess their defenses. Or, de assess the defenses. The Blood Elves did the same, although I doubt their ability to be discreet. Both are long past due for reporting back to us. Find them and make sure they are safe, or at least did not die in vain. Well. Okay. Okay, so she's the sil Okay, I know who she is. She's the Silver Hand person. I'm guessing for the Horde, we go over here and talk to them. Made sense. What can I do for you? Is it all the Dawn Guard? I think that woman just, even though she was a Blood Elf, I think she just talked in human. How very odd. Alright, we'll kind of just do that over time. Let's focus on this one. We'll rally people and we'll do all that as time goes on. I do like that we just... It's right here, though. We're finally fighting here. That is interesting. Oh, more quests. Blizzard, come on. I need a nap. I need a nap, Blizzard. Why are you doing this to me? Where even is it? <laughs> I just really got an eye hold. But yeah, this is clearly the elven problem one. Alright. Ah, here it is. It's one of the scouts. What do you need? Over here, Worgen, try not to alert all the guards to approach. There's the Blood Elf and a Worgen sitting in the corner discussing tactics. Nothing strange at all about that. The magic's in charge of the defenses here is powerful, perhaps too strong, even for the both of us. Fortunately, the Sindor I know a thing or two about magic. The mage's barrier is strong, but we are clever. He has somehow channeled enough energy into his staff to power another set of defense portals, but he has left it out of his sight. Bring me the staff and an energy source from one of those constructs. I should be able to create just the thing we need to take that shield out. Okay. I'm not gonna. What is this? Who goes there? What what is this? Who are you? What are you? Nightwell us. Right. I'm gonna be honest. Go fuck yourself. It's, I'm not doing you. I'm not, I'm not. No. That's a side quest. I'm not bothering. I'm sorry. I'm gonna be honest. I can't be fucked. If you're interested, do it yourself. Telling you how it is. Sorry. I'm pretty sure we don't have to do that, and I'm not in the mood to do that at all. I'm just not. I just want to do this at this point. Alright, there we go. But this is not bad at all. I'm not having problems with this as much. Oh. Besides just my normal Suramar woes at this point. Why are you evading? I shouldn't even be in combat with you. I did not want to fight you. Okay. What do you mean? Where's the staff then? Stop it. Where's the staff? All the way I wear. Where is that? Alright, let's just take a look. But yeah, I'm not bothering with that quest. There's no reason to. It's just a side quest. I can't be fucking bothered. I just can't be. Maybe I'll come back in the future. But right now, no. Just grab the staff and run. Get out of here. Retreat! Retreat! Thank God their thing is slower than the demons. I forget where that guy, how that guy's involved. These things are huge. Very helpful. All right. You know, it'd be nice if it would keep quest smart, you know? I think that'd be pretty good. That'd be pretty good indeed. All right. 
It is really child's play when you consider the magical weaves. I can see the flaws of just a few minutes of study. Excellent work. The weapon will provide me proper housing, and the magical signatures in the core will let me bypass. There you have it. One arcane nullifier. Use their weapon and magical signature to cloak the spell. It should tear apart the shield as good as any spellbreaker would. Go teach the am that amateur spell slinger what it means to wage war against the Sindori. The reckoning is at hand. This is becoming a problem. This is becoming a problem. Goodbye, I guess. Never to be found again. Baladash, Malanore. All right. We will have justice. It said inventory full, not quest log full. I just destroyed one of my quests for nothing. Do you hear this, guys? This is me smiling in anger. Okay. Thank Our you for that. Alright. So what do we need to do? Kill that guy. Got it. Simple enough. Simple enough. Where is he in here? Yeah, I got you. What the fuck? Get out of here. What you done? Gotten rid of your magic, of course. What else? Now we can take you right out. Bye bye Well, perhaps, but apparently, apparently, we were more perfect. Thank you very much. Apparently, we were more perfect. We are the true pinnacle of perfection. Thank you very much. Have a good day. Let me go do this now. Ugh. I'd imagine we're going to constantly go to Ella, or not Ellisand, um, Ellisand, what the fuck? Therese, or uh, whatever the hell her name is, more often probably at the gates rather than Merida, but we'll see. Maybe not. It would be cool if this area finally fits. Like, by fits, I mean, like, once we're done this quest line, like, the enemies weren't on this top floor anymore. That'd be pretty cool. I think that'd be great, in fact. Join us. Oh, fuck off. How'd I even get involved in this? It is crazy, though, how long we've spent working on Suramar. It's it's actually going to feel really good, finally, getting to Nighthold and putting an end to this once and for all. There you are. That's one of ours. Tread carefully. The Legion's presence is strong here. Have the Nightborn forgotten all we lost in the War of the Ancients? This way leads to destruction and death. Of course it does. Oh, good, too. This portal is a problem. With it, they can summon countless reserves. The crystals nearby seem to be powering the gate. If we destroy those, we can set them back significantly. Will do. Powering down the portal. Destroying the crystals will stop them temporarily, but it will be meaningless if we do not deal with the person controlling the portal itself. I heard their overseer Ingra, shouting orders for more power so that she could bring the stronger legion lieutenants for the gate. We must stop her to truly see the portal for good. Farewell. We'll do then. Is that her? Yes, it is. Okay, this is the kind of quest I'm okay with. This seems pretty simple. Let's get the portal out. Take out this one crystal. Bye-bye. That's a really slow cooldown. I almost feel bad for her. Or cast time, I mean. Here come the blood elves. Did you just say infinite legion? You know, that would be an interesting title to give them. Infinite legion. Kind of like the infinite dragon fight, like it's just a bunch of legion in time. Like, I just killed her. What's the point 